have you ever tried parking, whether it's on Main Street or in Campus Town Ames, only to find out you don't have change? Well, I've got a great tip for you. It's called Park Mobile, and you can pay for your parking meter with your phone. Let's take a look. One of the first things you're going to want to do is download the Park Mobile app onto your phone. The next thing you're going to do is look for the zone number on the meter. You're then going to open up the app, put that zone number in. You can scroll around or search for it. And then what you're going to do is put in the information on your vehicle, the type of car, your license plate, and then you're going to put in duration. Is it a quick 15 minute trip or will you be there for three hours? And then you go ahead and put in your payment information. Typically it's a credit card, a debit card, or even Apple Pay. So one of the great things is once you get the app set up, it's really easy. You only have to put your vehicle information in once. So once you're at your destination, if you find out that you need a little bit more time and it's all rainy, you don't have to come out and feed the meter again. You can just extend the time. Now, the one thing to keep in mind is there is a fee. It's about 55 cents, but for me, it's definitely worth it. And here's a tip. Even when you pay online using the app, it is still gonna show expired. When the Ames police is coming through looking at parking meters, they're using the app information. So one thing I learned is if you leave early, you do not get your money back. There's no refunds. But I guess that's pretty much the way it is. If you put three quarters in and you leave early, you're not gonna get your quarters back either. This is Misty Metchke, realtor with Huntsker & Associates. Definitely give Park Mobile a try. It may just be your new best friend.